Hello and welcome. I'm Sandy Karras and what you see behind me is the Hog Island Lighthouse. This is in Nassau in the Bahamas and it is the little lighthouse that greets the cruise ships as we come into port at Nassau. It is a very important lighthouse and it has the distinction of being the oldest still standing lighthouse in the Bahamas. We're talking about 700 islands there and may well be the oldest one in the entire West Indies. Indies. It qualifies um, with a starting date of 1817, which is very early by Caribbean standards. So there it stands alone on the very tip of that craggy little sea level point of a place that was once known as Hog Island. You see, when the heir to the A&P came and visited in the late 1950s, he saw that island and envisioned it a tourist draw. I mean, what can you say? The beaches and the palm trees, it is absolutely gorgeous. There was just one hitching point because the name, let's see, Hog Island, not so inspiring and maybe not such a draw as maybe something like, oh, Paradise Island. And so it was renamed Paradise Island. Fortunately for historians, the little lighthouse was not demolished and it still retains its original name of Hog Island Lighthouse. It's 62 feet high and it is accessible to climb. Some guests have done that. I've never gone out there and actually done so myself, but that might be something that you want to do to, um, to add to your list of things to do next time you're in there out in the Bahamas. And that's what you need to know about the Hog Island Lighthouse. See you at the next lighthouse.